Before we get into the video, I would just like to say that I'm going to be giving away a Titanium White Octane at 500 subscribers. So if you want a chance to enter into that giveaway, all you have to do is like, subscribe, and of course if you want to turn on post notifications, as well as comment your gamer tag down below with the platform that you play on. And best of luck, I'll get into the video now. Yo, what's going on? Welcome back to another video, and I hope everyone is having an amazing day. But we're going to be starting off the trades by selling a Crimson Emerald that we bought for 310 credits and a few ads, essentially just making a non crate very rare profit, which is not bad um, considering we have so many Crimson Emeralds. It's nice to get one of our, out of our inventory, and hopefully, we can sell a few more later. And if you guys, once again, I'm going to mention it, want to join the Discord server, um, the link's in the description. There's giveaways on there as well as um, trading tips and advice from me or other subscribers of the channel. And there's special servers for each platform so you can talk about trading tips on there as well. Um, but moving on from that, we're going to get back into the trades here and we're going to be picking up two painted emeralds for 320 credits. So that's 160 credits each. And you may be wondering why I'm picking up so many painted emeralds. We picked up a ton of crimson ones in the last video as well as black and now we're picking up other random colors it's because you can get them for very cheap um, i'm buying each of those painted emeralds right there for 160 credits and they go for around 400 at the minimum value so that's insane profit right there even if we sell one of those for the minimum value we're already making back the profit and actually making a little bit of profit right there um, so I highly suggest you guys do that with any RLCS item as long as you're underpaying by quite a lot because RLCS items are quite hard to sell. We're also going to be selling our stipple gate that we picked up for 600 credits. So that's an easy 100 credit profit from um, when we picked up last time. So very happy about that trade right there. And moving on from that, once again I'm going to mention all the emeralds. We have a ton of emeralds in our inventory so I'm going to be trying my best to get rid of them as well as picking up other items such as this hex. We're going to be picking up the hex for 100 credits. It sells for 250 to 350 and it is one of the worst black like on the lower end of the black market scale um, just because it's so inexpensive and in my opinion it doesn't look very good so uh, yeah. But moving on from that, this is probably the biggest trade of the video. We're going to be selling the rest of our Crimson Emeralds, I believe. There are, so each trade is eight. There's 14 Crimson Emeralds in there, and we're going to be selling it all for 4,500 credits. And we paid 310 credits each. I don't feel like doing the math in my head right now. Um, so, I just know it's, we're going to be selling for profit. I'll actually do the math right now. So if we do 4,500 divided by 14, we're selling them for 321.42 each. So that's around 11 credit profit on each of those, which doesn't sound like a lot, um, because it's not. We're basically making um, around 140 credits, if you think about it. So it's not a lot for all those emeralds, but I was just happy to get them out of our inventory. But moving on from that, we're going to be selling also our Dune Racers for 1,400 credits. And we picked each of these up for around half price and sold them for all for around... I think 100 under min each or somewhere around that. I know we were definitely making profit off of that. I can't quite remember what we bought each of them for. But I do remember that we bought this black Octane RLCS for 750 credits and we're going to be selling it for 1,500. So that's an easy 750 credit profit from another RLCS item, guys. So I can't say this enough. If you guys are looking to make a big profit fairly quickly, I suggest you buy RLCS items. And the more expensive they are, the more you can underpay and the more profit you can make. Um, for example, that black Octane RLCS, um, it was more expensive than any of the emeralds and we were able, able to make more profit. Um, but right here we're also going to be selling another black emerald. I just kept some of the black ones because they're a little bit easier to sell because they are more um, likable color. But we're going to be selling it for 550 credits and 4 non crate very rares, which is not a bad offer at all considering we paid 400 each. So it's 150 credit profit plus 4 non crate very rares once we sell those. Um, that'll be a total of... I would say over, um, I can't do that in my head, I also forgot um, how many non-crate very rares, very rares there were already, um, I think it was 4, so it's around 120, so 270 profit off of that black emerald, sorry it took me a little bit right there, but we're going to be swapping our pink dingo that we picked up earlier for a pink fennec, which once again is a very good trade because dingoes are very hard to sell and fennec is definitely a lot easier, so we'll definitely be taking that trade right there. And this is also the other big trade in the video. We're going to be selling all the stuff we picked up in previous episodes 
for 7,850 credits. Um, so in the total, yeah, so he's doing 7,850. The total is um, all the dingoes, all of, pretty much all of our emeralds, and black octane RLCS, and octane RLCS 2021 to 2022 purple. That's going to be it for the video, and I hope you guys did enjoy.